Hey everybody, welcome back. So glad you're here with me today. Today I have for you update number two in my TV show project pan roulette. And we will start off, no, not by that. I'm pulling up the document. Um, New Amsterdam, I picked Pixie Hydrating Milky Mist. And we were at that black line, and now we're at the silver line. So hopefully I'll be done this in like a month. And then, da -da 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 -da, the Wreck-It Ralph makeup remover for CSI, because it's all science-y kind of looking. Um, we were here last time, and with this dark glass, you can't... Sometimes you can see through it, sometimes you can't, and tonight's not one of those nights where it's cooperating. But I maybe used it maybe once or twice, so we're probably like a little bit below that line. I'm still using it, so. And it's getting used, that's the best thing. And my hand's getting oily from my grape. Alright. Mm -mm -mm. The Smurfs, I have the anti-stress mask. We're still at that black line. Since I made that line kind of thick, I've used it maybe once or twice, but I will be using it in the future, obviously. Um, this this might take me to the end of the year, but I don't really care because I like it. And, like, it's all about curating, too, as Jen taught me. So that's why we're there for the Smurfs. I finished the product for, uh, I have for FBI, because the little dude's in an FBI jacket. It is The Pit from Zany Laney. So, we are done that. <clears throat> uh, the Neighborhood uh, Dry Oil is the, this, um, it's called Mermaid Hair Dry Oil from the brand Kiss Meow. And this is my first time marking it, and we are right there, where that silver line is. And then there is, for recess, the Cake Body Mousse in Desert Island. We are where that silver line is. And I'm using this faster than I thought I would, but I really, really like this one. It's the Body Mousse. I have another one that I haven't really touched. I might give it away to someone. Um, but it's like a body milk. But I prefer this one. And it smells freaking delicious. <laughs> uh, for My Name is Earl, I picked a sample lip glass from MAC in Love Child. I've used it a few times. You can't tell on these. But I have been using it. Uh, the next is Rick and Morty. I had a wax based on Rick and Morty that I finished. Also, I added two other waxes that were, um, they had a booze note in it. So, uh, those are downstairs and I finished them. I just didn't bring them up and put them in my empties yet. This was in my room, so <laughs> that's what went in. And then for bones, uh, the Eliza Vecca Hyaluronic Acid Memory Cream. Now, you can't really see. I think you could see it's like right there because the package, it's kind of like it has walls. So it's smaller than the actual packaging. But I'm pretty much halfway to a quarter done so i'll be sad when this one's done because it ha i think this is what mostly helped me with my acne lately so i'll probably invest in like a hyaluronic acid serum or find this again because this is like a gel and it's a great moisturizer uh then now we have to since I got rid of three, or finished three, we're adding three. And I randomized Fraggle Rock, and for that I have another Zany Laney. 
because I have it. It's called Pass It On. And see the little gobo. And this is actually a scent I helped created. One of I think the first scent I helped create with them. And it's apples, rock candy, and peppermint. I wanted to taste like I wanted it to smell like I imagined doozer sticks tasted like. So that's why it's that. Uh, next is the nanny. And with that, I am picking now nanny fine is all bold and beautiful okay she's loud and what else, what makeup product is the loudest in this generation but a highlighter i am going to try to make a dip in since she is flashy from flushing <laughs> I'm going to use this Pretty For Your Face highlighter. I'm either going to use it until I get a dip in it, or I'll use it for like three months and then cycle out. Because it's all about curation here. We're not like, oh, I have to use the whole product up. Using a whole highlighter, that is, it's possible, but you have to really work with it. And I'm not about that life. So there's that. And then the last one uh, show I generated was a Sister Wives. And if you don't watch, you probably think it's really weird because of the polygamy and everything. But they're kind of like a normal family. Kind of not. And But the Sister Wives, they always have each other's backs. And I give it to them for that. Even if some of the things they believe in, I don't believe in. They always have each other's backs, okay? <laughs> or sometimes there's fights. But, you know, the point I'm getting to is this is a product that has had my back lately. And it is, I got it in Ipsy. It is the Jelly Pong Pong Watermelon Lip Oil. Now, you can see here, I know if I mark the glass, it's just going to rub off because it's like a glass. But we are about there, like in the middle of the L in lip oil. And I use this at night. I use it whenever my lips feel dry. It tastes amazing. I know that's not the point of it. <laughs> and it smells amazing too, like watermelon. And what's summer coming? Watermelon's a thing. So... That is what I've used. That is my progress. And that is what I am rolling in. Um, whenever anyone else does an update, I will link them down below. Because I think Andrea's doing this and Jen. I don't think Kalina's doing this. But I could be wrong. But as people come in, I will link them down below. I thank you for watching this and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.